high five open up. More likely, it's going to be another three, four, maybe even five hours. The Washington Department of Transportation says they plan to and hope to open one lane of northbound Interstate 5 sometime later this evening. That's as much as they can narrow it down, but at this point, that's what they're hoping for. And one lane's better than no lanes, which has been the, the uh, situation for uh, more than a day, actually. Here's what's happened today. Essentially, contractors had to pull down any loose rocks and trees on the hillside above the side. So all of that stuff wouldn't come crashing down on crews that were cleaning off the highway. Now, they had considered opening a southbound lane to northbound traffic, but figured setting all that up would take as long or longer than cleaning up the mess on the northbound side. Washington Governor Jay Inslee stopped by the site today. Interestingly, just about the time the tornado winds were moving through battleground, and like a lot of people, he says he's getting tired of all this crazy weather. Two worst fire seasons ever. Um, you know, floods, uh, water, drought. You know, we had Forks, Washington, rainiest place in the United States, had water restrictions this year. I'd rather we hadn't, didn't have to deal with that, but we do. And that's costing the state a lot of money in emergency funds that could be used for other things. Inslee says it's nice, though, to see the worst conditions bringing out the best in people, a lot of neighbors helping neighbors, that kind of thing. He gives a lot of credit to WashDOT and the contractors they hired. They've been working night and all day today in this nasty weather to get the freeway clear as soon as possible, but also as safely as possible today. The Woodland Safeway, where we are, they've been giving out juice and drinks and coffee, donuts and bagels and fruit and sandwiches to all the stranded drivers who are here. They've been doing that today. Maybe have to do it again tomorrow. One lane is what they hope to have open tonight going north, and it may be well into Friday, even Saturday afternoon, until all the lanes are open. In Woodland, Joe English, K2 News. So many road messes out.